<laughs> All right, welcome back to Let's Play Pure Solar HD. We are currently at the Hunter Lodge. There is a item that we want to get here. Boom, a potion. That's going to be the only item here. This is where things are about to start getting weird. Um, hello. Don't move! What are y'all doing in my place? Honey, lower your weapon. They seem harmless. Turn around and let me see your faces. My apologies, sir. We're travelers, and well, to be honest, we really need a place to rest. Ah, I see. Sorry about the harsh welcome. We don't get no visitors around here. So we have to be careful. But as long as you ain't got no ill intent, you can crash here. No offense taken. We understand. Thank you both. Here, you must all be tired. Make yourselves comfortable. Your home is, um, lovely. Must be peaceful here. Definitely. We done, done been here since we married. You was only the second group of visitors we had this year. Really? Yeah, a while ago, a woman and her son came through here. Oh? The woman was gorgeous. Her son as well. But creepy. Cold as ice. Done near froze my nipples off. <laughs> yeah, well... <laughs> That's awkward. The boy. What's his name? Well, he kind of reminded me of you there, young. Me? Oh, posh, of course. He does. You hardly see anyone, and you're even worse with names. His name, uh, Cleo something. They, they all look the same to you. Oh, yes, Cleo Neo. They all look the same. I suppose... Funny y'all found our house on your way to... where? Other side of the tree. We have to go through the tree because going around it seems impossible. <laughs> going through the tree. Yeah, like, which tree? Thick vegetation everywhere. Uh, I'll help. Help starts with the beaver. First we need a beaver. The fatter the better. Then please, make yourselves at home. I'll start dinner in a bit. You stay with us, yes? We'd love to. Let's look for the beaver. The faster, the better. The fattest, the better, dummy. Either way, let's go before it dusk, so we won't find any. So, they don't chop down trees with uh, with an axe. They they get a beaver. It's a little weird. And now we have to actually go find the beaver. So, I'm just going to save the game again. And it says here... This is actually something that you have to do only in the HD version, not in the 16-bit version. Um, but it says that the beaver is... He's near where you found the saw. Okay. I'm just gonna look at my map for that. The saw is pretty far on. But I don't think it'll be too tough. So, starting from here... We go down this way, here, and here, as fast as possible. Here's another fight. Oh, look, I'm all rested up, though. All right. Um, let's rumble. Air blow. I love saying that. Just rolls right off the uvula. Nice, critical hit. I guess I really don't need to be using a Cupid bow right now. So I'm gonna switch that up. Ah, oh, come on, I just did it again. Oh well. I, I might be able to rest up with the hunters again soon. It's near where I found the saw. Let's 
Oh, look at me, I'm still using the thing. Cupid bow. No, who cares? Oh, there he is. Hey, little buddy. Hey, it's a beaver! Yes, but let's approach him carefully. These wild animals can react very violently when cornered. Oh, but it looks so docile. Work? Do you see? He likes us. It appears that way. Maybe he'll come with us then. Quirk, quirk! Sounds like a yes to me. Let's take it to the lodge. <laughs> the beaver is just like, yeah, sure, why not? Let's go. What a friendly little beaver. So I don't really know why I have to take it to the lodge, because the tree that I'm trying to get through is not at the lodge. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Air blow! Please no poison, please no poison, please no poison, please no poison, please no poison. Please no poison. Alright, Alina. This time, I'm gonna remember to give you that dang old bow. Yeah, that's gonna do a lot of good. Oh, gotta go this way. Gotta go this way. This way. This way. Advantage! Bring it on home, Sally. Killing everything in sight. Kill, kill you, stab you, smash you, ball you. Oh, 
shoot you. Ball you. Stab you. I'm a killing machine! Victory! The team earned a grand total of 198 gold coins. I earned a level. <laughs> I earned one level. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, let's go talk to these hunters again. Please know we're in about battle. Oh, uh, Bambushed. You think I care about your stupid bambush? Eat power. And aqua. And fire. And hammer. And air blow. The victory! The team earned a grand total of 304 gold coins. Hey, whatever, whatever. Alright. Back to the Hunter's Lodge. Please, no more random battles. Thank you. Save, of course. Hello? As long as you ain't got no ill intent, you can crash here. Please make yourselves at home. I'll start on dinner in a bit. Wait, what? Whatever happened to, uh... You know, the beaver thing, you know. Okay, apparently I didn't need to go back there. I thought Hostin said let's go back to the Hunter Lodge. Oh well, now I just need to go to the tree. Well, did I end up healing healing up or no? I didn't. All right, Alina, do your thing. One for Hostin, one for Crawler. Crawler's like, hey, don't forget about me, man. I'm always hurt. Alright, now to get back to that pine tree. Shoot. I really just did way too much backtracking. That I didn't have to do. I could have sworn that Hostin was like, let's go back to the let's go back to the hunter lodge with the beaver, you know? Maybe that wasn't the case. Alright, well. We're almost Almost done with this stupid pine forest. All I have to do is go from this end to the other end one more time. And we will we will do it. We will be through it. Be over it. Uh, he got poisoned, and you know what? Since I don't want him using up any more of my precious items, I just leave. Um... No, you know what? I'm almost through these guys anyway. Alright, cool, he's doing a regular attack. He's not wasting any of my items, thank gosh.
excuse my language. Sorry. And Crawler's almost at half health again. This is a little baby man. He's like, oh, there, boo, boo, boo. Ah, great. Now Rudy's. All right, we're just gonna run away from this one. I don't normally do this. Let's screw it. It's not. It's not worth. Too easy, man. I got, what, three crits out of that? <laughs> Yay! I've gained like a million thousand levels since I've started this uh, Pine Forest. Be so super strong soon. Baby needs his medicine. That should be good enough. All right. I still find it kind of funny that all the enemies are in their 16-bit uh, pixelated formats. And all, yeah, all the sprites are, whereas all the uh, all the scenery and stuff is all like HD hand-drawn and has got awesome shading and stuff on it, light effects. I just noticed that on the map, it like kind of highlights where all the rabbits are. One of them's, yeah, one of them's up here, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, it does show one being right up here. I don't know why it would highlight that though. They're just rabbits, no significance really. He's got two more air blood cats left, but I think I'm just about out of the forest. Come on, Mom! Yay! He's a bunny. Alright, this is gonna be my last casting of the air blow. 
From there on, I'm on my own, kid. Air blow! One last time! What? Hey bunny, pet pet pet. All right, now I need to get to this tree right here. There it is. No more battles, please. This is the tree. Let's use the beaver, please. Ah, maybe I need to go to the inventory. Beaver, beaver, beaver. There's no beaver in the inventory. Who the heck's the beaver? It says in the strategy guide, use the beaver at the offending tree. Where beaver is? Found the offending tree. And I found the beaver. So what the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay, so it says that I need to go to the lodge again. Screw this, I'm running away. I need to go to the lodge and look at the cage there. Oh. <laughs> Why? Why? This is so maddening. Alright, get the heck out of here, who cares? Just had a thought. I don't think this will work, but I want to go into options. Hmm. Oh, there's actually an encounter rate? Wow. I can go to half times encounter. Oh, dude. No encounters. Hmm. Yes. Oh, I can go to 16 bit sound. And HT plus. For the theme. I guess that's extra HD, better graphics. No, oh, I didn't really realize this before. Yes, there we go. It gives okay. It gives the uh, sprites some filtering. They're still 16-bit sprites, but they're they're filtered now, so it gives them sort of a, uh, a smoother look. So wait, no, let's see if I can just use Lasso to go back to the beginning like I did before. There we go. Yeah. All right. Save one last time. At least I'm getting a lot of money by doing this. That was awesome. I didn't know I could just turn the encounters off. Ha! <coughs> <coughs> yeah. Sorry. See y'all got a juicy one. Must be tender. I need my dear Raquel. Raquel! Raquel! I don't want to yell because I don't want to peek the mics. Are you calling for your wife, sir? I think she's right there. Ah! Hell no! Raquel's my machete! I must be somewhere else, damn it! Take the beaver outside so we can get started. As soon as I find her... There's something about these... About men who name their devices... Tools. Hmm. Is that our meal? That's gross! I thought he asked for the beaver to help us get out of the forest. That... That old potato bag, so sneaky, using us to hunt his dinner for him. Wait a second, are you thinking what I'm thinking? We can use the beaver to chop down the tree. Or, Mr. Smarty Guy, we could use the saw that I have. I think it's safe to say that no one was thinking that. You're underestimating the little guy. If he's from around these parts, he's more than capable. Okay, let's assume you're right and not completely batty. Austin drops white powder into the two of the tea cups. Oh, shit. He's drugging them. This tea is delicious. Don't forget your cups or they'll get cold. Oh yes, of course! Here, honey. 
Good. You know I hate cold tea. Is this going to work, Hosta? <laughs> Wait and see. I hope he didn't just kill them. I don't know, they're sleeping. It even causes memory loss, so next time they see us, they won't even remember that there was a beaver. Good job, kid. Now let's get out of here before they wake up. You've just got this item. Beaver. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Alright, well thankfully I have encounters turned off. So glad I know about that now. And also the filtering for sprites. Doesn't look good, but looks better than it used to. And let's just zoom all the way down there. And then after that I'll turn encounters back on, because I think encounters are, uh... I don't know, they're integral. Integral part of the RPG experience. But I've already done way more encounters than I've needed to do in this freaking area. So let's just forget about them and move on. Yeah, look how much faster this is going. Here's the offending tree. Inventory beaver. By the power of my beaver. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Silly question. How do we know he'll chop down the tree and not just run away? Oh, I'm sure he'll get the point. He owes us after all. Besides, he's a beaver. He's slow. It's not like a hedgehog or anything. Are hedgehogs fast? Damn straight, and don't you forget it! <coughs> Everybody knows that hedgehogs are fast as fuck. Alright, he's doing it! He's doing it! Oh my god! Oh my god! Good beaver. Huh, it worked. They're a proud and honorable species. They don't leave debts unpaid. I think that will go down as one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. I'll second that. Let's go before we have to rescue any more forest animals. Alrighty. Oh, somebody's probably tailing me. I wonder if that's actually Murto. I mean, it has like the same graphic as the bottom part of his face. And if it is, I wonder if I'll actually face him in a battle. Alright, so I'm going to end this episode right here, and we'll pick, up, pick back up at the lake. Or maybe much. Probably much. I don't know. We'll see.